Very, very warm welcome to you on what is, of course, a truly special day in this part of the world. It is Derby Day. A rivalry so deeply entrenched into the history of sport in this land. It divides opinions, it divides families, it divides just about anything that can be divided. The game itself lasts just 90 minutes, but its repercussions can be felt for months and years ahead. The stands here, the Corva, as the locals call them, make for quite an impressive sight, all in support of the grand old lady of the Italian game. This is a friendly, but a friendly only in name. Well, I'm sitting here, Peter, thinking, is it possible for these two to meet under friendly circumstances? This exhibition match is likely to exhibit the same old rivalry. To me, it also has the same feel to it. And I'm pretty sure we can look forward to what will be a combative, high-intensity affair. We can't really well, say. Good evening to you. It is great to have you along for this much anticipated game. And of course, we want to get through it as promptly as possibly we can because, as you can see for yourself, there have been major weather issues today. The officials have made absolutely sure that it is safe, it's okay to go ahead. Nothing has been left to chance in terms of preparations. Those have been meticulous. And understandably, when you take into account these most testing of conditions. All of the efforts to ensure this game is played under normal conditions have been carried out and we hope for a proper game which reaches its conclusion. The Emirates Stadium in all its glorious modernity, this symbol of new Arsenal, the Arsenal of the 21st century. Two high-profile, high-caliber teams. This is a welcome event for all these supporters. Well, under normal circumstances, this is a massive matchup, and I'm not totally in agreement with the view that friendlies tend to take the edge away. In my experience, if the opposition go at it full tilt, then you have to reciprocate. We'd like to see excitement and be entertained. Very warm welcome to you on this most pleasantly clear evening. Conditions absolutely beautiful. Perfect for the beautiful game. Temperatures are kind as well. No doubt playing a hand in high attendance levels as well as an elevated level of anticipation here. Surely this is the hot ticket going around in this neck of the woods. It surely must be. The Camp Nou once again decorated in the colours of Barcelona. This is what greets the players every time. as friendly as it can be in the circumstances but you feel the rivalry well, I'm sitting here Peter thinking is it possible for these two to meet under friendly circumstances this exhibition match is likely to exhibit the same old rivalry to me it also has the same feel to it and I'm pretty Lovely sure day. absolutely glorious weather here as we welcome you to a football match of considerable significance, great consequence in this part of the world. They've been talking about this one for a while and they have rolled up to it in fantastic numbers. You should have seen the roads outside the ground in the Aratoon leading up to it. 
it has been bumper to bumper the traffic has been extraordinary but the level of expectation is also very very high and uh, these supporters who uh, were queuing around the block for their tickets as soon as we knew the date of the fixture well now they can't wait for it to begin and begin it will any second now this is the inside of the Veltins Arena, a sea of royal blue, the colours of Schalke. What are you making of this formation, Jim Beglin? Well, I can tell you, Peter, that I actually always like playing in this formation because as a wing-back, you get more freedom to go forward. As an orthodox full-back, you had to be more selective in the runs you made. The back three should be able to deal with certainly one opposition striker and, and possibly two. And that's why I liked it. Because I Well, hello, one and all. This, of course, the penultimate game before the big day, and there is a matching sense of occasion here. Uh, just waiting for the last few supporters to come in. So many people wanted to make it here, and there is congestion outside the ground. We're not surprised to hear that. Well, the first leg was a tale of two contrasting sets of fortunes, and both sides, in their respective manner, would be attempting to convince themselves that it is not quite over yet. Old Trafford rising to the occasion as only Old Trafford can. Some terrific scenes at the Stratford end. Inevitable outcome or a dramatic turnaround? One or the other. I just can't see how a team that's produced such a professional performance first time up can suddenly go and throw it all away. If they do manage to do it in style, it would serve as a real statement of intent ahead of the final. So, perfect blue skies, almost no wind, beautiful sunshine. These are in the conditions for the beautiful game. The backdrop here, picturesque, idyllic. No doubt one of the best days of the footballing calendar, and it has added to a really jovial, happy mood in the stands, helping to raise the level of sound by more than a few decibels. Shirt sleeve order, very much the dress code. The Bayern fans singing their songs. This indeed is a super club in so many ways. This is the perfect game for all parties, not least the neutrals who've just come to enjoy it. Well, under normal circumstances, this is a massive matchup, and I'm not totally in agreement with the view that friendlies tend to take the edge away. In my experience, if the opposition go at it full tilt, then you have to reciprocate. We like to see excitement and be entertained, but if it does go down,